What's up, YouTube? It's Toron coming at you with another episode of our survival let's play. And today, I am moving stuff to the new storage room I made. And I'll show you guys my new storage room here in a second, but... I'm going to turn up the sound just a little bit. Alright. And let's see. And I will move the lapis later. I have so many eggs to move, it's not even funny. And we can move all this stuff. Actually, um, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to gather a few things in my inventory to get ready to move, and then I'll be back with you guys momentarily. Alright, I have an inventory full of stuff to move. And now let's go to the storage room. And I ended up building it over uh, near the, well, I'll show you guys. I was working on uh, this area over here and decided that I wanted to build it a little ways down. So you have uh, the animal farms and then you come up here and you have this intersection and then down here ta-da so I wanted it to look like some almost like uh, the outside of a big huge giant temple type thing I don't know um, or maybe just a big giant indoor building uh, but I went ahead and wired the door so the wiring for this goes back there back there and then underneath uh, there's no switch inside because I figured uh, you're only going to be coming at this from one side. And then here's the inside. Uh, you have the chests, which I've already moved a few things into, just not everything. Um, over here you have the ender chest. And it's a little special room here. Up top here we have just more chests available. And... Um, so we have five, we have 20, uh, 20 chests in each level. So there's a total of 80 chests to store stuff in, which hopefully will be enough. Um, but I guess if we later, if we needed to, we can always push back and expand, or I can always bring this out and add another row. I can always want to put another row right here across and bring this stairway out to cover it. And then we can do uh, the floor. Over here I have enchanting. I put a couple anvils to use. I have the chest of books and I have the chest of enchant of already pre-enchanted stuff. Um, and then over here I have the smelting center, and this is my garbage collect my garbage. So I went ahead and uh, just made a little thing back here, so that I could throw stuff away if I needed to. It's out of the way. It's not anywhere that's going to be in the way. Um, and these I've already filled with some coal, and then I put some hoppers on them. That way I can come over here, toss in like cobblestone and then walk away and come back later for the stone that I need like that's what I did with the floor here to make all these um, but yeah I spent probably a good two and a half hours on this room uh, the biggest pain in the rear was collecting all the um, quartz but I got it and some extra so it worked out pretty well Let's see, gunpowder. Uh, we better go ahead and make a new spot up here for some of this other stuff that we don't use very much. Too bad this isn't feed the beast where I could just double click and have it. Or too bad there's not a way to double click and have everything from your inventory just go in like a barrel. And 
diamonds, spruce leaves, eh? Uh, I guess we can start a, a leaf one. We'll put all the different types of leaves in these, though. Uh, coal, feathers, bones. Let's see. I already have one for bones. I don't have ones for spider eyes, so we'll put that here. Not that I think I'm going to get a lot of spider eyes, but still. And then up top we'll do the feathers. Um, but yeah, this is pretty much what I've been spending most of my time on recently, is getting this thing done. I wanted to have a nice place to put everything. Um, and this is what I came up with for the design. So you have to let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, but I, I kind of kept the floor similar to the main room where you have this as the outline and then regular stone. But I wanted to also have like a path for the stairs and stuff. So I went with the quartz box and then I put glowstone to light it up. And let's see, diamonds. And anything else I need to get rid of? Oh yeah, more coal. Cool. There we go. All right. Um, but yeah. So what I'm gonna do is tra finish transferring my inventory. I just love that. It's awesome. I went with the same idea for the door there that I have for the door coming into the base. Uh, I wanted to go with the same type of an idea. Uh, so I, I pretty much copied the design for the door. But the only thing I need to do is make another way to get over here that doesn't take as long. Because uh, right now I have to run quite a ways to get over there. Not that it's that big of a deal. It's just kind of tedious when you're trying to transfer stuff. I do want to make another way into the base at some point too. I still need to work on that. Uh, we'll do the lapis later. Ooh. I think I might put all the wool into a single one as well, just to keep things easy. And then all the wood, I'll probably separate the wood. Alright, well I'm going to finish collecting and moving stuff, and then I'll get back with you guys and we can figure out what we're going to do next. So I will be back momentarily. Alright, and we're back. I finally got everything moved. Um, I still have a few open chests that aren't being used yet that we'll have space for for stuff later. But we have everything moved now. The only thing left over is the beacon I brought, the nether star, and the dragon egg from when we killed the uh, ender dragon. So, but yeah, we got everything moved now. Uh, stuff that is made from sticks is in there. Nether quartz. Um, gold. Iron. I added some crafting benches to the sides. That way, um, it's easier to make things. And this is my, no, excuse me, this is my um, drop-off chest if I need to empty my inventory for a moment before I run around and do stuff. Uh, but I need to eat, actually. Then I need to figure out what the next big project's going to be. So we got the storage room finished, which we were wanting to work on. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do next. Oh wow! Where'd you come from? Yeah, that's right, sucker, die. I wonder where he came from. Hmm. He would have wandered around from somewhere. The block lighting around here is pretty good. But yeah, we have our cows. The piggies. And our sheeps. Is. Oh, I need to go check on the chickens. Last time I was up there, they were making eggs like crazy. Let's go check on the chickens. Yeah. 
We need to go and put a bunch of these. Let's just go up here and check on them. Uh, if they start, if they don't, if they keep producing too many eggs, maybe we'll just have to get rid of the chickens. Um, not too bad, at least. We'll just have to go. I'll show you guys how many eggs I already have taken out of there since we've made this store drone. See eggs. Yeah, as you can see, I've already almost filled up this double chest from there. So I may have to just create a uh, a machine to throw the eggs for me, and then kill all the chickens and gather the feathers and the um, the chicken. Because I don't have a lot of raw chicken yet. But I'm gonna I'm gonna need we're gonna need to do something about all these chicken eggs eventually because I I have enough for another double ch I have enough for another single chest up there and that's gonna fill out pretty soon. Oh, I bet you they're coming from the middle here, but right here. Yep, that's it. Fine then. I'll have to add some lighting to the ceiling. That's where they're coming at. It's right there. Oh well. No biggie. And I'm thinking that I'm going to close off this. Get rid of all this. Block it in. So the only way up would be this way. And then over here, I can do something else entirely. Maybe make another entrance coming in from over here. I'm not sure. Not quite sure yet what to do. Oh, hey. I didn't realize that, but we could go this way. We can always make another way to get over to... Uh, it's just as long to go that way as it's good. Maybe not as long. Hmm. Interesting. Making my brain work. Well, I'm over here. I may as well grab this. Oh, look. Cool. Not like I don't have enough of this stuff already. I can't wait for the new... I should actually go to the snapshot so I can start making myself uh, coal. Blocks of coal. Instead of having to have all the the individual pieces of coal like I do now, I can start making blocks. And that would save me some space. Like with the redstone, I can do blocks of redstone now, which is awesome. Maybe being able to do blocks of coal. You to I think I'm gonna make another portal down that side. over yonder and why not um, you. oh no wrong one you what else have I got? Bone. 
the rotten flesh. I don't know why I keep the rotten flesh around. Maybe one day they'll do something more with it. Who knows? I know Feed the Beast you can do stuff with rotten flesh, which is awesome. But in normal Minecraft, not quite... Not much you can do with it. No, get back. Thank you. Okay. So I've been slowly picking up ores and stuff as I see it. I went ahead and widened this hallway here. Because um, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this up area, this way up here. Or if I'm going to limit the way to go up over to here. Um, but we still have this area here that goes to the ravine. This over here leads to the dungeon I found. Down there is the, the zombie spawner. Over here is the part of the abandoned mine shift that we found. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with that yet still. Then over here, I haven't decided what I want to do with this area yet either. Oh, too far to reach. Uh, but there is, there is uh, the ravine down here. It does have lava in the bottom, but it also has the, that. So I'm not quite sure what I want to do with all this area yet. I'm still still deciding. I mean, I guess I could always turn this all into one giant staircase up, but that'd be kind of a waste, I think. Or center the staircase and then go around it to do other stuff, maybe. Like do a centered five staircase and then have a path either side of it to go behind to do something. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, I'll think about it and figure out what I want to do. In the meantime, though, I need to figure out what to do next. I want to make an automated brewing room that will, based on the uh, the potion I want, send the ingredients to the brewing stand, create the potion, and then after it's created the potion, dispense it or something, I'm not sure if that's even possible right now. I want to mess around with it. Until then, though, uh, maybe I'll put the brewing in this area here. I'll replace this lava with the water. And I'll put my brewing in this room. For now, since I got rid of the storage. Though, I probably should put my brewing somewhere else. So that it's closer to my ingredients. And I still need to expand my farm eventually. Oh, hello slimes. But for now, this works pretty well. I get plenty of carrots and potatoes and wheat and reeds and nether wort. I saw this area over here that we can do something with. I haven't decided yet what. Maybe we can make ourselves a, make ourselves a slime farm somewhere. But yeah, I gotta. I do want to make a a monster, a um, an actual spawner farm. Where the monsters drop down and I have things that collect what falls. Using the new hoppers I'm able to do that. Um, but I haven't quite decided yet. I do want to go exploring some more around. I haven't really been exploring up top. 
I want to go on a on a journey and see. I'm thinking that I might upgrade to the snapshot and then we can go exploring for horses. Because uh, I haven't really explored a lot around us up here. And because of that, if we do it right, I can probably go and find us some horses. We can explore and find ourselves some horses down there. That's what I'm hoping at least. So what I'm going to do probably is for the next episode I'm going to upgrade to the snapshot. And then we're going to go looking for some horses. I probably... Hmm... Yeah, I'm probably going to bring this this in here and just have that and then go straight over to there. But either way, what I'm going to do now, though, is call this an episode. I just wanted to give you guys an update about what's been going on. Ooh, I need to fix that, too. Need one more there. And I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. And then what I'm going to do is... Upgrade to the snapshot, and then we're going to go exploring for some horses on the next episode. So look forward to that, you guys. Uh, but anyways, thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. I appreciate all of you. And take care, everybody. Peace.